Hello and what's up? This is Malhar yet again back with another video. In one of my last videos, I've showed you my line follower bot and also showed you the tuning and performance of this bot. But one of those main features which this bot lacks is a wireless control. So I was working a couple of days now with that ESP module and as you can see it's currently in working mode. My ESP module is working with my bot and now I can control my bot with my smartphone. And as you can see I have designed everything in here you can see all those six sensors will light up and you can control your bot manually and this is the error meter and these are the motor speed indicators this is right motor and this is left motor so this app is actually kind of cool and you, you can control your bot manually also manually with your smartphone and also track the bot movements and everything with this app as you can see this is mode this is currently in manual and i will show you how it works this is my bot okay and this is joystick and you can see I can control it using my smartphone <laughs> and as you can see also there are three sliders down there the P and D controllers I have not put the I for a reason I will show you obviously later and the bottom most slider is for the initial motor speed I have showed everything which are this P and I and D constants and also initial motor speed in my previous video link here you can watch that if you like it I mean if you want it you obviously have to watch it before before watching this video and also in this video I'm not going to show you anything with this app as in the title you can see I will show you how to design this thing which is hanging over there this thing is actually kind of cool and I have to plan two days for this how to design it and as you can see there are some complicated shouldering job in here as this thing is small the response of the sensors I'm blocking one of the sensors see the rightmost sensor you can see it's blinking and also in the bot it's kind of cool isn't it you don't have to look at the bot sensors because it's moving you just can look here to see all the sensors going and also the error meter it's currently locked in minus 90 before because of a design issue maybe I have to fix it which I obviously can I will show you how to design these apps also in one of my one of my future videos so as of now as you know these modules need 3.3 volts and anything above 3.3 volts will fry it like sh and unfortunately my this bot's power supply have two voltage values one is 12.6 volts which is obviously variable from 11.1 .1 to 12.6 volts that's the total voltage of my lithium ion cells and then there is a buck converter in here i have showed all of these in my previous videos that steps the 12.6 volts down to 5 volts to power up my arduino but unfortunately these modules cannot be powered by 5, five volts supply and I also don't have another buck converter to step the voltage to 3.3 volts so I came up with these voltage regulators LM317 these are actually kind of cool and you can with suitable resistor networks you can create whatever voltage you want this is the simple formula and I, I have to put these resistors to get 3.3 volts that's kind of cool isn't it and this is the circuit diagram so without wasting time, let's go to the build, shall we?
Hope you like it. Isn't it cool? As you can see, this is so small and simple. And yet, it can do really a good job in here. And also, the supplying 3.3 volts stable power supply to these modules are kind of hard because these modules are power hungry, as I've told you in my previous video. So, this is a really good practice to use a LM317 regulator, adjustable voltage regulator, to power this thing because this thing can supply up to 1.5 amps easily. I'm not supplying that much amount of power though, that's why I'm not put a fit heat sink in there. If you design for such demanding tasks like 500 milliamps or higher, then you may you might want to put a heat sink in there because you don't want your regulator to fry, isn't it? So this is all for today. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Thumbs down for the opposite. And if you haven't subscribed yet, click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell icon to get notified about my latest uploads. This is Mother. You are watching our syllabus. And for today, I'm signing off.